Hey folks, welcome to another VR video. I know it's been a while. I know I missed the entire week of Halloween, but I have been quite under the weather with a sinus infection. My voice is still not entirely there, but I wanted to start out this week with one of the games that I was planning to play uh, last week. I wanted to do some horror games and affected the manor recently updated with an update called The Gauntlet. So we're going to check out the gauntlet. It should be a three to five minute experience. That may be all I can get through for today's video. Um, just because I'm really not, still, still, still not feeling perfect. Now the gauntlet, the instructions as you see here, you push forward on your thumbstick to accelerate. The longer you hold, the faster you will go. Your speed and the amount that you scream will be rated. Now, I am not a screamer, so you're not going to hear a lot of that. Um, but I will try to go as fast as I can. I believe my record right now is 3 minutes 22 seconds. Right, here we go. The countdown is on. 3, 2, 1... About a minute in, this furniture is just floating. It's not really in my way. Those bats are also not really in my way. This door is helpful when it opens on its own. Um, okay, so we're going this way. Okay, let's try this one. This one, I, I just know it's by looking at it. It's a pretty low duck there. I think this is the part where it's going to stuck you. Yeah, look behind you. Yeah, that's fine. I don't need to look behind me. I'm sure there's something awesome behind me. All these scary pictures. Another door coming up. It's a duck pool. Flies out of the bridge. Alright, we're gonna go with the door on the right. I'm sure all of these doors. Oh, it says no, you can't take it. Crazy little girl. Now that baby, I'll tell you, that baby's kind of scary. I love this chessboard. This is actually one of my favorite parts of this particular experience. The chessboard where all the pieces are moving into place. No, there's an easier route to take, but they're slowing me down. Coming back. It's two minutes and fifty-nine seconds. Two minutes and sixty seconds. I don't know if anybody noticed that. It's fine. Let's see if we can get there faster than 322. I don't think we're going to. Here we go, and stop. So we got 322 which is actually not terrible. We got wrist ace as our rank. Uh, 4,135 points. So that is the gauntlet mode. 
we're going to go ahead and click the menu now. And that was just a quick video, quick taste today um, of Affected the Manor. I wish I had gotten to do the horror games that I wanted to do last week. Uh, one of the other games that I wanted to play and feature more of was the Exorcist Legion. Uh, Affected the Manor is a game that actually did get a new update in addition to the Gauntlet, the Darkness update, which came out uh, giving some enhancements to the Quest 2. With that, you pick up this candle and you can actually play in a much darker environment as you go through the manor. Uh, if you want to see my manor video, you can actually go back. I actually posted in my community tab last week. You can go back and watch my video of the manor, watch my video of the Exorcist Legion on the original quest. Uh, Exorcist Legion does not have an update for the quest 2, uh, but I was going to play a little bit further into the game. Unfortunately, I'm not going to get to do that right now. Uh, I do plan on having other content this week. Um, I don't know if I'll get three videos like I usually try to do. But depending on how I feel and depending on how my voice holds up, depending on how my sinuses hold up, I will try to get more content out this week. Uh, one of the other things I do want to mention, you'll notice I have the original standard headband. Um, the Elite strap just really did not work out for me. Um, neither did the VR cover. They're both back in their original packages. Uh, I did order from GoQuest VR the GoQuest VR Halo Mod Strap, which if you're a pre-existing customer, they actually give a really substantial discount on. So that should be coming in the weeks ahead. And I also found some silicon covers, so I'm hoping that those work out as well. Until next time, get out there and enjoy some VR for yourself. I apologize for the brevity of this video, but I will be back with more content as soon as I am well enough to do so. Thanks for watching, and see you next time. Bye-bye.